there's times where there's days where probably Ivy walks on the field in the top two, uh, but not every day. You know, it's it's and that's that's really the big thing we're, we're, we see right now is a little bit of difference between the ones and the twos on defense of of the guys that come out here and compete in game mode every day, and the guys that had a good couple days in a row and then they kind of you know put their foot off the gas for a couple days. And, um, yeah, so I, you know I think I think Mike Jack has been the uh, been the number one, which is, you know, he played really well last year, and, and we expect him to be a great leader for us in that room. Um, and then beyond that, you know, I think I think Trajan's had better days the last two days, um, but it's it's an ongoing battle. And do DJ and Gil look like kids who can help you right away? Yeah, they have no choice. They have no choice. I mean, because, you know, we got what we got, and, and Sammy and Nigel Bethel shows up, and then Hal Blade shows up in the summertime. Um, we everybody we have in our secondary has got to got to assume a role somehow, some way. But but yeah, we, if we're, we're delighted we're here, we recruit all those guys again and give them a chance. Manny, Jordan Willis has got the suspension, but also been playing games last year. Are you confident in him that he can be a reliable player for you, or does he still have more to prove to, to be a more reliable player? Than you have a guy you can count on. No, I, I I see what you're asking, but I think that's even fair. I mean, it's like it's like uh, you know he, he's a new guy. He really is. He's really changed. He's, a, he's an outstanding young man. He's a great guy on our program. He's done everything we've asked. Um, and, you know, it, it would be unfair to hold something over something. You know what I mean? Like, that's just not the way that life works to me. And, uh, and all we ask is that, that he's, a, he's a great teammate. He does everything that the program asks. And he's been, he's been uh, you know, straight A's across the board. So we're, we're super excited about who he is as a person. Um, because ultimately this game will end for him at some point anyway, and, and, and so you know he's going to be a, he's going to be a man forever, and I, and I think he's turned into an outstanding man. And, and the fact that what he does on the football field as a player is really exciting. Can't wait to watch him play. Is there something, is there something specific that you can point to that gives you those indications that he's doing this differently? This it's, it's just the way it's the way he attacks everything. It's the way he is around the, the building. It's the way he is in the weight room. It's the way he is around the, the coaches and his teammates. You know, I mean, he's just he's a program guy now. What are you looking for? Scrimmage number one. What's the most important thing for you? Uh, how much does it mean as far as as we move on? Scrimmages are big deals to the defense because we tackle, you know, and, and we have some limited tackling opportunities in these practices. But you know, as a defensive football player, you're defined by, you know, your ability to get a guy on the ground. So that'll be the whole whole day where we have, we'll have to do that. Um, the other thing that happens in a scrimmage, you know, we tell them it's a game. You know, college football is the only sport where you don't play an exhibition game with somebody else. So we tell our guys, this is a, in, in, at any level, okay, so this is a preseason game for us, similar to like in the NFL. And so the accountability is real. You know, if you don't hold your gap and practice in the run spits, we set the ball down just to play again. On Saturday, it's going to be a touchdown or a first down. You know what I mean? Conversely, you know, when we when you make a tackle in the backfield, it's going to be second down to 14. That's going to help us get off the field. So the guys have that accountability, that real game accountability of, of their positive plays, but also their negative plays. So what you get to see for a young guy, for example, can you rebound for making a negative play? Well, all of a sudden, if, if the guy, if, if your man catches the ball for a touchdown, does, is that it? Are you in the tank? You know what I mean? Because we start the season in chaos, right? LSU in that environment, and there's no way we can practice for it other than, than in these scrimmages. So, so it's, it's a big part of our evaluation. Are the 